Papenburg is just a small cozy town in northwestern Germany. But it has one of the busiest and most famous shipyards in the world, the Meyer Shipyard. Meyer Shipyard was founded more than 200 years ago in 1795. It has been a family owned company ever since. More than 50 cruise ships were constructed on the yard since 1985. For example, for Royal Caribbean, Norwegian Cruise Line, Celebrity Cruises and Disney Cruise Lines. The Meyer shipyard in Papenburg uses to deliver two new cruise ships every year. But the yard is not even located near the sea. So how do they get their ships to the ocean? The only connection for ships from the yard to the sea is a narrow river. Every new cruise ship constructed by the Maya yard needs to go over the narrow river Ems. This very first voyage for every new cruise ship constructed in Papenburg is always a spectacular event. For the reason of better buoyancy, the cruise ships are even maneuvered backwards along the river. Thousands of spectators are watching the ship going down the River Ems. On their voyages towards the sea, the ships need to go through tight curves of the river, which even allows a limited draft. They even have to pass extremely narrow sections of the river. In order to make that, they require the assistance of powerful tacks. After having left the shipyard by passing the yard locks, the ships are reaching the small town Wiener. They need to pass an old railway bridge constructed in 1951. This bridge was out of use for several years. After a ship, the Ems Moon, going down the river, Alighted with a bridge and destroyed the superstructure. 
Since then, the cruise ships used to pass the ruins of the railway bridge. This section sometimes is even passed during the night, which makes it even more dangerous. Further miles down the river, the ships need to pass a bustier bridge. Spectators used to have great views of the cruise ship going down the river when it crosses a four-lane highway. On their way, the ships pass the almost untouched nature on the banks of the river. Finally, after a voyage of approximately 8 hours, ships are reaching the River Ems Barrage. After having passed this barrage, the new cruise ship is finally reaching the open sea, the North Sea.